I am Dr. Prashant Chain, uh, Consultant Orthopedic Surgeon, practicing at Pons and Joints, JP Nagar, 5th Phase, Bangalore. Any break in the continuity of a bone is called as fracture and the process of fracture healing starts immediately as soon as the bone fractures. There are three phases of fracture healing, phase of inflammation, repetitive phase and phase of remodeling. Phase of inflammation is the one which starts immediately after a fracture wherein the bone starts bleeding and secreting uh, PRPs which help in the formation of new bone around a fractured bone. This is called a stage of hematoma formation or inflammatory phase. The second stage in the inflammatory phase is phase of fibrin formation wherein the uh, platelets uh, form fibrinogen which are which connect the bone end to end at the fracture site and start laying the bone matrix. The stage 2 of fracture healing is a repetitive phase where fibroblasts are laid into fibrin formations in the inflammatory phase and then the phase of re resorption start where the bone edges are resorbed by the body so that new fibrins can get a firm hold on the fracture ends. The third phase or the phase of remodeling starts with the formation of soft callus which begins approximately at around 3rd to 6th week and continues to up to 3 months. This stage of soft callus is a stage where the bone is formed around the fractured bones to give it stability and support and the patient in this stage of the soft callus becomes pain free with movements and therefore plasters and splints are removed after 3 to 4 weeks of fracture when we see soft callus on x-ray. The other stage of uh, remodeling is also called as phase of remodeling or internal callus formation where the internal callus is formed bridging the fracture sites and the soft callus around the bone is absorbed. The total time taken for a bone to remodel from the date of fracture would be approximately one, and, one to one and a half years.